Welcome to the Dean Blackman Show, live from Long Island. Free-flowing talk with a charismatic, down-to-earth host. Join Dean as he interviews and chats freely with his guests, ranging from superstar athletes to politicians, industry titans, and everyday folk with fascinating life stories. Dean educates, entertains, and most of all, touches people's lives. You're listening to the Dean Blackman Show, live from Long Island. Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Dean Blackman Show. My special in-studio guest here is Seema Levy, my good friend, and uh, back to being a star here on the show. As she uh, was in the early stages here, sat here when when the show was just podcasting and was just audio. And uh, it's great to have you back, Seema. Thank you very much. I'm so excited to be here again. Great. You got to speak more up on uh, up on there. That's terrific. Great. You look great. Your studio looks amazing. Super, super. And I'm very proud of you. And I'm thrilled to be here and share some amazing information with everyone. Well, super, super. Listen, for those uh, that don't remember, uh, Seema Levy is the founder and CEO president of Mother's Art World. And uh, listen, these days, uh, book, nutrition, uh, lifestyle coach, uh, whatever I've missed, you correct me. I think you're doing great. I also launched Art of Your Body. Art of Your Body. Which is a health coaching institute of focusing on not only on the right nutrition, but also habit change. Wow. Mm -hmm. Listen, tell tell more about that, the book and, and all about nutrition. Okay, so the book, there is a book coming out. It's going to be called Started from the Bottom, Now We're Here. <laughs> so yes, Drake, shout out to you. Um, right. And it's all about nutrition from when you're young. And as you get to become an adult, what you do as a child will affect a lot of things, including autoimmune disease, autism, and a lot of different um, diseases. The reason I got into it is because Many of my friends are all suffering from some sort of autoimmune disease, and we're all pretty young in their 30s and 40s. And, um, you know, I I volunteer, as you know, at the hospital, and I never understood why everyone has autoimmune diseases, and especially thyroids, um, overactive thyroids, underactive thyroids. And in through my research, I had found that food has a lot to do with autoimmune And I know we have fabulous doctors. The doctors are working very, very hard. But I do think that doctors don't have time to tell their patients every single little thing and hold the hand through the process of what to eat, what not to eat, when to eat, how to consume the food. Um, And I believe that's where health coaches come in. They teach them how to eat, whether it's eating slow, chewing your food for 30 seconds, 30 times, um, eating on time. But not only that, I feel like, you know, the, um, I'll give you a little inside information, but a lot of people suffering from thyroids have consumed soy products uh, during the 90s. And that's why the epidemic of thyroids came about, uh, that I have um, came about through my research. And including myself, I eat a lot of thyroids and I have an overactive um, thyroid, so I have to kill myself at the gym. Um, And when I killed myself at the gym and ate all the right nutrition, I was still bloated. And I didn't even, I never understood, Dean, why I was so bloated. I mean, you looked at me and you always said, oh, you look good. And yes, I'm a thin person, but now my stomach is hard and it's it's not bloated. And it's because I eliminated all soy products. Soybean in itself is actually poisonous if you ate it in a raw, which is very interesting. But not only that, when you take um, anything like tofu, tempeh, things in that nature, it needs to be refined. So when you there's chemicals involved when you refine um, soy, and it leads to a lot of different autoimmune diseases, especially in the thyroids. Um, it just simply disturbs the hormone. Am I talking too much? No, I just want you to talk closer. (laughs) Just want you to talk closer to the microphone because I want everybody to hear you. Okay, I hope you all hear me. But um, yeah, it's a hormone disruptor. So it literally disrupts your hormone. 
Um, edamame is is uh, the baby soybean, and when it's cooked, it's okay. It's the refined soy that I'm talking about. You know, you I'm I'm sitting here across from you, and uh, one of the greatest things about launching my show and my shows, whether it be in studio here, the Dean Blackman Show and Dean on the Street, it's uh, that I've had the opportunity to meet great people like you and that have become special friends of mine. But I'm listening to you, uh, what's going on in your life now besides Mother's Art World, and uh, I'm shocked when you mention bloating because (laughs) Sharon and I, we follow you all the time. We're one of your biggest fans on Facebook, my my wife Sharon and I. We're one of your biggest fans. And I are You are uh, a beautiful, beautiful young woman, great heart. Thank but uh, shocked by the bloating, <laughs> and I can't, I can't think of anyone, anyone to be a better uh, coach Aww. on nutrition than Seema Levy. Thank you, I appreciate okay, it. Okay, so it's great that you took the scores up. What, uh, what's going to be challenging is I don't know if you have any physician or doctor friends I that are have... watching this that are going to challenge you and take you up on uh, on some of your comments that you made about uh, physicians and doctors. I am speaking to two people. They know who they are, and they also are my friends on Facebook. Um, I have meetings set up, and it's very exciting to work with these, hopefully work with these two people, because I think that they're fascinating, and I love their energy and what they're all about. So I will keep you posted, Dean. Well, listen, on (laughs) on this topic, as you know, back uh, back in the 70s, my Mm -hmm. family founded a a nutritional company and I was in the wellness industry as well. We had a company called Twin Lab where we uh, developed and marketed nutritional supplements under the brand Twin Lab. So under, under supplements. So this whole thing with alternative medicine And with what you were saying about physicians being open-minded, I do have to compliment the young generation of physicians today Mm -hmm. that from a couple of decades ago, at least three decades ago, things have changed. And I find uh, physicians have become more open-minded to um, nutrition, supplements, um, and really, really have taken the time to Oh, be open-minded and learn more about it, okay? They really are. So yeah. listen, all I know is I see Seema Levy all summer, man. She's out east. She's out in the Hamptons. Beautiful pictures. Thank I you. mean, you got to tell everybody, how do you stay so healthy mm. and so stunning? Well, I thank you. <laughs> but um, so beauty is from within. Whatever you put into your body is just like gas. You know, if you have a Ferrari, you're going to give it the best super gas in order for it to run efficiently. <laughs> so um, your body, it's the art of your body. Your body has an intuition and it will tell you what you need and what you don't need, um, especially your blood type. Um, I eat extremely healthy, but I have to change certain things that my blood does not require. For instance, um, the soy products are totally gone. And if you are uh, blood type B positive, I would encourage you to eat less chicken, a lot more fish and red meat, but less of the chicken. There's a reason to the madness. Come see me. Um, but also... Uh, what I find is that you have to eat according to the sun. So think about this. When you wake up, eat between, let's say you rise at 7 a.m., you have an hour and a half to eat your breakfast, and that's your fuel for the whole day. So eat um, by 8.30, and then eat your lunch between 12 and 1. That's when the sun is the hottest and your body is the hottest. So it's gonna, your metabolism is gonna be the fastest. And I want you to eat like a popper at dinner. So your smallest meal at dinner, and please do not eat past 7.30 unless you're out with friends. Wow. Yeah. Well, listen, that sounds terrific. And uh, for years I've said I've gotta work on this belly, and Mm -hmm. I'm hoping that you could become 
mm-hmm. my coach one day. Let's do it. Okay, mm-hmm. and uh, and do something about uh, do something about that. Listen, let's get to to mother's art world because yeah. that's how that's how you and I came together and that's we right. met. And as I said, uh, uh, Seema Levy is the founder and CEO, president of this uh, great great company called Mother's Art World in Plainview, yeah, uh, Long Island, New York, and. Uh, she teaches, uh, she's got a curriculum and songs and books mm-hmm. and teaches, uh, beautifully teaches uh, uh, children art, history. Yeah. Um, what else can you share that I didn't just share about Mother's Art World and obviously the work that you're doing with Cones Medical? Okay, um, so Mother's Art World is my baby. Everything came from Mother's Art World. I'm super proud of it. and what I've done with it and will continue always to do with it. All my books have been revised. The revision was not in the content of the story or the illustration. However, each book has additional 10 pages of color, color pages. So the kids will color works of art by the artist after reading the story and uh, viewing the illustrations. So now it's an activity book as well. Each book is an activity book. My fifth book is done. It's called A Sunny Sunday with Surat. It took me a long time because it's not only a story, but uh, an activity book where you connect the lines and there's, um, you know, color pages. However, I'm not settling with this book. It's one of my favorite and I am looking for a literary agent. Wow. So if there's a literary agent out there, please contact me. I'm sure you will not be disappointed. This book belongs in any museum. Um, I can see it at the Met, Metropolitan Museum, at the MoMA, Dorsey, um, even um, um, in Europe. I mean, I can translate it. I speak a couple of languages with a little help. I'm a great. <laughs> well, listen, we're on we're on throughout the world here today. So, uh, well, any literary literary agents out there? This beautiful young lady, Seema Levy, she needs you. So, literary agents, if they want to reach Seema, Seema, how do they reach you? Um, Seema Levy three at gmail dot com is the easiest way to reach me. Wow, I'm telling you, whoever doesn't know Seema, she's a rock star. She's yeah. unbelievable, and if you haven't met her, literary agents, you got to get a hold of her. So uh, some great stuff that you're doing, and it's just amazing. Um, you know, husband, kids, yeah. visionary, entrepreneur, everything that you do with business. Uh, I don't know how you do it all. I love it. It's, it's passion. It's I've great. Heard before, like you, you it's have great. a passion. It's unbelievable. And we have some fun out here. We Isn't have so great? much fun. I, mean, I love it out here. For you to travel to Setauket here on Setauket. the North Shore. <laughs> <laughs> I remember I remember when, when you and I first met and you invited Sharon and I over to your home and yeah. we were in your home for about 10, 15 minutes. Yeah. You were, I was pronouncing your name wrong. Yes. You were pronouncing Blackman wrong. <laughs> And uh, your lovely daughter. Uh, Paris. Yeah, Paris. Hello, Paris. Hi, Paris. We're saying hi to Paris on Facebook Live and across the world in the studio here. Hi, Jordan. Hi, Logan. But Paris. But uh, hello, Seema's family. And uh, you guys are all welcome to come in as well anytime. And Thank you. Seema's friends, anyone that's got a story, an experience, a business, mm-hmm. this is a great experience here to be able to come into a studio here right in my home and, and broadcast around the Amazing. world. So uh, um, it's really it's really great. Anything else that you want to talk about? I know I, I love being here and I encourage people to start great nutrition and reading. So whether you're in Mother's Art World or Art of Your Body, it goes hand to hand and in hand in hand, mind, body and soul. So I encourage you to read, eat right and just simply be happy. Shut down all those negative people and the people that want to sabotage you. I think I posted today. My message will always be that people around you are all have issues, some sort of an issue. Some of those people will still be happy and, you know, shine, but others will want to demolish you and wow. sabotage. Wow. Stay away from them and just smile. What beautiful, beautiful comments. Hey, listen, when I was following you out mm-hmm. east this summer, yeah. 
did you did i see on your facebook that you met uh, one of my favorites sharon, sharon stone, stone. Sharon. wow yeah. 1992 mm -hmm. i'll never forget it a classic yeah sharon stone michael douglas in oh. basic instincts Instinct. I mean, uh, that was wild. She was great. She was great. She was uh, one of my all-time favorites. Mine as well. And I have to tell you, I do not get starstruck. Like, I want to talk to stars like I'm their friend. This one intimidated me. <laughs> and um, she was lovely. I had to speak with her because I idolized her. And she was super nice. And her boyfriend took our picture and took a couple to make sure we both looked good. <laughs> well, maybe 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 one day when you guys cross paths again, they could come into the studio here and do a show with us. Oh, let's do it. That would be super. That but listen, listen, I want to thank you so much again. Thank you're, you. You're you're a doll. Me. You're a sweetheart, a, a dear you. friend. And uh, as I said, uh, everybody, uh, don't be shy. Uh, we've got the the Dean Blackman show here in studio. You've seen me, Dean, on the street, all over the place. You're all over. I'm all over everywhere. Yeah. And uh, and then now we're getting ready to do a, a new format show called The Dog House that we're looking for people to, to come on. That talks about just current events, what's going on, what's the big story. We look to put people into the dog house. You never oh, know who it's going to be oh, and how you get out. But it's a lot of fun. It's a little bit edgy and it's some really cool stuff. It's like called that. It's called The Dog House and uh, you're going to hear a lot more about it. And there's going to be other shows that we're doing. Oh, every sure every day are. this is all evolving and we welcome all new ideas and subjects guests and stories but you know that anytime you're welcome out to my house here i appreciate it okay thank you very any much. anytime you've got thank an open you. invitation thank so you. uh with the jewish holidays coming up shana, uh, tova. shana tova and i wish you nothing but i know i don't have to you're yeah. you're a picture of beautiful health oh, but more of a, a heart of gold okay thank you the the the, in, the interior is is even more beautiful than Aww, than the outside. But thank you, thank you, thank you again for coming. You might as well say goodbye to our Facebook thank friends, because then so I'm going to say goodbye to everybody from all of us at the Dean Blackman Show. My my special guest has been Seema Levy, CEO founder of Mother's Art Art World in Plainview, New York. She's also a, a nutrition coach. And a lot of things are, are happening around her. So mm -hmm. be sure to follow her, literary agents. But from all of us at the Dean Blackman Show, take care and have a great day. Bye-bye now. Bye. Thank you. You've been listening to the Dean Blackman Show live from Long Island, New York. From all of us here, we'd like to thank you for tuning in. We look forward to hearing your comments via Facebook, Twitter, Skype, and email. And don't forget, you can visit the webpage anytime for the up-and-coming guest list. From all of us here, have a good evening.